What's up legends? It's been quite a while since we've opened up a MetaZoo booster box, but I just could not resist the chance to open up MetaZoo's new Hello Kitty themed set. This is Karomi's Cryptid Carnival. It's the newest expansion in the MetaZoo TCG and a very unique collaboration. So if nothing else, I'm very intrigued by this set and I do enjoy opening up some MetaZoo. So let's go ahead and open up the Karomi's Cryptid Carnival booster box. Now guys, if it's your first time here, my name is Luke, and if you like to collect shiny cardboard and chase nostalgia like I do, you're in the right place. Make sure you hit that subscribe button below to come along the collecting journey with me. All right, very intrigued by this. Let's rip into our booster box. All right, so we got some of our characters on the front here. So for those of you who are maybe confused, kind of like I was, um, I guess Karomi is just one of the characters within the Hello Kitty universe, I guess we could say. So I believe that's her right there. And uh, yeah, so this is a collaboration actually with Sanrio. Again, I feel like if I keep hearing all these terms thrown around, Sanrio, Hello Kitty, Karomi, and I don't really know what any of these things are, but you know, through a quick Google search, I guess uh, Sanrio is the Japanese company that um, is the owner of Hello Kitty or the creator of Hello Kitty. And so I guess they have a lot of other little characters in there like Kuromi. So I think we're going to see um, maybe some of the, the Hello Kitty characters in this set. And I believe it's kind of coupled with um, chibi versions of the MetaZoo cryptids. Very cool, very unique. If you would have told me that this was uh, happening, I I don't know. I would have thought that this is a very strange collaboration, but um, I don't know. Maybe maybe it works. We're gonna find out. I can't remember if there are uh, <laughs> card tricks for MetaZoo. It's been too long. All right, but let's get right into it. So I guess we yeah we got the Chibi Beaver Shark. So yeah, so even just starting off, we are getting the chibi. So that must be what this set is, is a chibi set. Just kind of the uh, baby cute versions of the characters, which is kind of cool. They've done that. They've kind of sprinkled it in in different sets over the years, starting with like the Valentine's Day set, which is a, is a really great one. All right, Okopogo. I don't recognize some of these characters. Sheep Squatch. <laughs> nice. All right, so you got him coupled with Karomi there. We got My Melody's Melody. I guess this is another Hello Kitty character. I think it's like a, almost kind of like the uh, the nice version of Karomi, kind of the rival to Karomi from what I understand. Nice. Okay, we got our reverse hollow here, the Chibi Hypnosis featuring... Uh, um, oh my goodness, I can't even think of it, of his name off the top of my head. Uh, Wendigo, there we go. I, I don't know why I could not think of that. Kind of cool. I, I like that, that version of him. <laughs> nice, we also got a Chibi Loveland Frogman. Gotta, gotta love him. Chibi Explosive Rabbit Forest. And there we go. So, it appears that there is a four card trick. It's kind of coming back to me now. All right. Here we go. Okay, and we do have some different pack arts I'm seeing here. Very cool, we got the Chibi Bunny Man, the Chibi Moth Man. Those two guys. Yeah, it looks like maybe three different pack arts. There we go. We got the Chibi Achi something. I, I don't even know. We kind of missed a few sets here and there. So, some of these characters I don't even remember or recognize, so you'll have to bear with me. Card quality is feeling pretty good though on these. Have the Hesh Sheep Squatch again. Chibi Gassy. Yeah, that guy. I've never been able to pronounce that guy. Ooh, nice. And we got a Karomi. That's uh, probably a good one. It is a full hollow. Karomi with the heart eyes. We'll take it. All right. I mean, uh, I would think if that's kind of the main character, that's got to be a, a decent one, right? All 
All right, nice. We got the Chibi Hodag. I like that. It's a nice artwork on here. Who is this by? Kelsey uh, Giacchino. Explosive Rabbit. Chibi Quetza. One of the OG Chibis, technically, from Cryptid Nation. Karomi. Non hollow there. Hey, we got the Hodag. Nice. Okay. So we got some hollow versions of some of the ones we've seen so far. I like that a lot. And that's something that makes me excited about this set, too, is I, you know, I like the original, a lot of the original characters that they introduced in the first two to three sets. It starts to get a little much once you keep adding more and more characters, but. Yeah, because I really got into it around Cryptonation 2. Those are the characters that I've kind of come to enjoy from MetaZoo. So I, I like it when they have sets where they kind of reincorporate those original characters. All right, let's see if we can get a hold of these. All right, we got the Rainbow Crow. Nice looking there. The Chromie's Spooky Mask with the Mothman Mask. Chibi Unicorn. Romy and Sewer Alligator. Cool. My Melody's Melody Chibi Bookmark. What I'd be interested to know is, you know, did uh, Sanrio do any marketing for this on their end? Like, is this really just kind of a uh, something that benefits MetaZoo? Or does it benefit the other brand as well? Nice, we got the Chibi Mothman. Another original Chibi. Chibi Shadow People. And the adorable O-Lantern. Some nice artworks on these, I will say. Chibi Rose. Baby Rose. Okay, am am a gug, am a gug, something like that. Breakfast aliens. Ticket roll. Bullet. Cryptid cotton candy. Chibi. Uh, Partridge Creek monster. Karomi. And Melody. Still the non hollow. And we did get a reverse, which is the Henchy B Flatwoods Monster. Kind of cool. Chibi Enfield Monster. I do recognize them. A bunch of little little guys there. Nice. Chibi Spell. Mask. Chibi Grim Reaper. And he's even got the little Kuromi hat on. Nice. Uh, green Clawed Monster. Roller Coaster. Another Reverse Hollow. The Chibi Seep Squ Sh Seep. Sheep Squatch. She sells seashells by the seashore. <laughs> Mike the Chicken. Familiar. The Spookster, Kettlecorn, Ogua. Oh yeah, I remember that guy, the two-headed little dino guy. Chibi Wendigo. Hey, not bad. We got Chibi Sam Sinclair, the main protagonist in MetaZoo. Very nice. That's got to be a decent one, I would think, in the full hollow. All right, I have been kind of slow rolling this a little bit and and kind of butcher, butchering the uh, pronunciations hopefully we can kind of speed things up as we go along here but I you know as we're seeing new cards I do want to make note of them creepy mask breakfast aliens that's, that's a funny one to me some different ones we've seen already Kuromi again my melody I keep seeing that one and we got the reverse 
Kuromi's Cryptid Carnival Celebration. Nice. Okay, Chibi Adams. Uh, Adam, Sim, sorry. Adam Ackler. I don't know why I can't talk right now. GB Command. Nice, we got the Chibi Mothman. Very cool looking, just the reverse though. Chibi Snow Snake. And we got nice reverse chibi spell. Very cool looking. All right, let's go through this a little quicker here. Nice, we got something new, the chibi shadow people reverse. We have, oh, we got a full hollow. Nice, we got Adam Ackler chibi version. Very cool. Now what I don't know is in this set if they have a, uh, kind of like they do for the other sets, like the uh, Obnoxious 9 and all that stuff. Do they have a version of that for this set? Let me know in the comments below. Maybe it hasn't been determined yet. I think the set is still fairly new. I don't know exactly what day it came out. Reverse, we got Kuromi and Chibi Momo. A few new things here. Chibi uh, Pendulum. Chibi Ogopogo. Oh yeah, we saw that guy, I forgot. Anything here, this is okay. This is a reverse roller coaster. Familiar, Chibi Spell. There's a with the Grim and Kuromi. And we got a reverse Chibi Lightning in a bottle. Wow, they even got Chibis of the random little objects and stuff. I guess it's technically a potion. Sorry, for those of you who are really into MetaZoo, then you probably know all the, the names for these. Hey, Chibi Snipe. <laughs> nice, I like that. He's cracking out of the egg. That's a good one. Uh, Sentry Box Devil. Got this one again. And we got the Chibi Wahila. That's another cool one. Just the reverse though. Chibi Bildad. Sky Snake. Now there's the Bunny Man from the artwork. Here we go, we got a reverse, and this is Kuromi and Black Dog of the Hanging Hills. That's a mouthful. Anything new? Chibi Germinate, that's new. Kettle Corn. And our reverse hollow is the uh, Green Clawed Monster. We are definitely getting a lot of reverse hollows. And we got, nice, okay, that's a decent one. The uh, Chromie's Cryptid Carnival Celebration, and that is the full hollow version. Yeah, that's new, we haven't pulled the full hollow one of that. Tiny Hug. 
And we got a full hollow. Yeah, nice. We got the Chibi Flatwoods Monster. Very nice. I like that one. He doesn't look too much different than the regular version of him, but I guess he's a little shorter. Skunk ape. Picking his nose. What do we got? We got reverse melody. Not bad. I'd love to see the full hollow of that one. Wrong pile again. Let me kind of display our hits a little bit. We're not getting a ton of full hollows, so might as well show we, what we got so far. I feel like we've gotten some good ones. I mean, they some of those feel like main characters. Sentry box devil. Actena. Actena. Ooh, there we go. Kuromi and Chibi Unicorn. Full hollow. Very nice. There are still so many cards that I'm missing from my MetaZoo binder that I would like to fill in. I keep saying I'm just going to focus on those first few sets, those first few promo sets as well. But then something like this comes out, and then I'm back into it. Chibi Poltergeist. Kuromi's Fireworks. Uh, GB Partridge Creek Monster. I think some of these are new. Grim Reaper. Hey, I got another Flatwoods Woods Monster. Very cool. Sounds like the big, big chase for this set. There's, I guess, a secret rare, a numbered card. I think it features Mothman, if I'm not mistaken. Cotton Candy. And we got another reverse melody. Stone eating Gyscuctus classic. Chibi Quetza. It's a very nice artwork. I like that. Hey, there we go. Chibi Forest Elemental Queen, full hollow. Definitely a fun rip and uh yeah, it wasn't too expensive. I ended up getting a nice deal on Black Friday. Ticket roll. Paid, I think around $80 for mine. Chibi Yahasuri. Hey, we got a reverse with uh, Chibi Wendigo. I like that. But when I just checked on TCG Player, it seemed to be around $90, so. Or maybe it was 99. I don't, I don't remember exactly, but I'm sure there's deals to be had out there. Here we go. There's the reverse Foo Follet. All right, you just got a few more in the box here. Let's take them out here. And by the way, guys, I want to let you know about a really cool product. Uh, which is these uh, graded card stands and cases by Collect 3D. I really enjoy them a lot. You can get them for whatever grading company you prefer. So this is the Beckett version. But the best thing about them is that they have these little stand uh, pegs that kind of swivel out like that. So you can display your cards. Here is a, a PSA version of the same thing if you're interested in that. So actually, if you use my link in the description below, you can get 15% off your purchase at Collect3D. So make sure you take advantage of that if you want to pick up one of those. Okay, what do we got? We got a few more packs left. Let's see if we can pull something cool today. Just a reverse in this one. Chibi Breakfast Aliens. The Spookster. I like that artwork as well. Hey, we got another Chibi Unicorn Full Hollow. Yeah, I really have not even looked to see how big this set is. Let's see. So it looks like we have 103. Not huge, but definitely not small either. So I don't know if they have full hollows of all of these. Probably not. So, I don't know if we haven't seen very many yet. I'm sure there's a My Melody full hollow, so we've been looking for that. Uh, 
All right, let's, I guess we'll slow roll the last few here. The Spookster, Chibi Rainbow Crow. My Melody, Trick or Treat Bowl. Chibi Bookmark, Kuromi and Chibi Wendigo. Kuromi and Giraffe Possum. I don't, I don't think we've seen that guy yet. That's funny. And we got the Chibi Salamander Queen. Chibi Bildad. Chibi uh, Stone Eating Jai Scuctus. Okay, we skipped right to the reverse hollow there, the Ferris Wheel. And here we go. Second to last pack. I guess we'll save the Mothman one for last. Let's go. One, two, three, four with the chibi, I don't even know how to pronounce that. Trick or Treat Bowl, Rainbow Clouds, Flame Aura, Chibi Bildad, Jai Scuctus, Rainbow Crow, Carnival Fireworks, Chibi Bookmark. I don't think we've seen this guy yet. Lava Bear, nice. <laughs> Snow Snake. And it looks like a reverse hollow. That's the roller coaster. All right, on to our final pack. This stuff definitely has been fun. I think we got some good stuff. We'll take a look at it in just a moment. Let's see what we have in our final pack today. Let's get that last pack magic. You know, pull the secret rare. Why not? Chibi Snipe, Lava Bear, Rainbow Clouds, Light Aura. GBM Guck Tiny Hug. Oh, <laughs> that's actually pretty cool. You got uh, Babe the Blue Ox. So she's giving a hug to Babe. Adorable O Lantern. Cryptid Carnival Kettle Corn. Chibi Grim Reaper. Kuromi and Chibi Bunny Man. And I think. Okay, two left here. Chibi Wingok. And we're ending off today with a full hollow nice another one we've seen before the elemental queen well legends it definitely gets my seal of approval go check out karomi's cryptid carnival i think you'll have some fun if you decide to rip open a booster box we got some cool stuff here we even got the adam aklar the sam sinclair and karomi herself now, if you guys like the content today, I think you may also want to check out one of these MetaZoo videos here on screen. Give this video a thumbs up and subscribe below to support the channel. And lastly, I want to let you know that no matter what you're going through, you are not alone. God is with you and he loves you and we do too. I'll catch you next time.